Get Senograph Pristina ready for biopsy exams. Steps to follow. There are two biopsy plates, one for vertical approach and one for horizontal approach. Either of them can be attached to either the left or right paddle arm. If the horizontal approach is used, the vertical approach biopsy paddle with aperture is replaced by the horizontal approach one without aperture. To proceed with the horizontal approach, left access, the left paddle arm has been removed. The biopsy head is in vertical parking position and the right paddle arm is attached. Go to parking again and switch to the horizontal approach using the knob. Remove the biopsy plate with aperture and attach the one without aperture. Calibration Accuracy Check – Steps to Follow For vertical approach calibration accuracy check, attach the vertical approach adapter to the calibration needle. Verify correct attachment. Place the plexi plate and the calibration phantom over the breast support as indicated. Z equals 30 should face upwards. Compress 6 decanewtons. Scroll through the images and select the plane where the calibration needle width is greater and the tip is well defined. It should be close to the 40 mm plane. Place the marker in the target. Select the calibration vertical needle. Check accessibility and send the coordinates. The calibration needle is already attached to the biopsy slider. The target button is highlighted in blue 
Press the screen hardware button to drive the biopsy head to the target coordinates. The target button changes to green. Slide the calibration needle all the way towards the needle guide support. The tip of the calibration needle should touch the tip of the pin phantom tip. Let's now check the accuracy for the horizontal approach. Get Encore Inspire ready for biopsy. Before attaching the probe to the driver, let's put all accessories in place. Secure lid onto the canister. Secure large cap and tandem cap to lid of the canister. Place the canister into the console. Connect the yellow tube to the center of the canister lid. Insert the cassette. Connect the large tubing of the cassette to the empty port on the canister. Connect the saline cassette tubing to the saline recipient and place it in its dedicated slot. Close the covers.
Program the Encore device and needles in the Pristina Serena system. Steps to follow. Encore Inspire Needles Calibration Accuracy Check. Steps to follow. Calibration accuracy check is done for both 7G and 10G Encore needles, vertical and horizontal approach. Calibration accuracy check for Encore 113 10G horizontal approach. Place the 1 cm plexi plate and the calibration phantom over the breast support as indicated. Z equals 30 should face up. Compress 6 decanewtons. Scroll through the images and select the plane where the calibration needle width is greater and the tip is well defined. It should be close to the 40mm plane. Place the marker in the target. Select the Encore 113 full 10G horizontal needle. Check accessibility and send the coordinates. 
The target button is highlighted in blue. Press the screen hardware button to drive the biopsy head to the target coordinates. Attach the probe with its adapter to the slider and slide it all the way. The needle goes through the needle guide. The tip of the pin phantom should be about in the middle of the notch. Calibration accuracy check for NCORE 113 10G vertical approach. The target button is highlighted in blue. Press the screen hardware button to drive the biopsy head to the target coordinates. The target button changes to green. Insert the VAD vertical needle guide support. Insert the 10G Encore needle guides, both metallic and plastic. Attach the adapter to the slider and slide it all the way down. The needle goes through the needle guide. The tip of the pin phantom should be about in the middle of the notch. Material preparation.